sure most of you have already heard the announcement made by Mr. Hiram early in the morning today regarding Use Your Hands campaign. Now, what you all actually have to do is that you have to come down to school on Saturday to actually help to clean up the school. Now, I've heard many grumbles among you about why must you come down to school on Saturday when you actually have cleaners in the school to clean up the school. Well, that is why I chose to speak to you today because I want to explain to you what are the benefits of actually coming down to school on a weekend to help clean up the school. Okay? Now, firstly, in two years' time, all of you here would be leaving primary school education. So here in Excellence Primary School, we want to train you to be responsible young adults. Day to day in school, we think little about our cleanliness, about who cleans up after us. Knowing or unknowingly, we actually walk around school, we throw it on the floor, we spill, sweet, <coughs> we spill sweet drink, we pluck the leaves out of plants, and we don't really bother about who is going to clean up after us. Now, on Saturday, we will actually see the repercussions and the consequences of our actions in school every day. When the cleaners come to actually clean up our mess, what exactly, how big is our mess? What exactly do the cleaners have to do to clean up after us? So after this Saturday, I hope that all of you, all of these primary fives will actually bear in mind um, how to react, how to behave more responsibly when you are in school regarding to school cleanliness and cleaning up the school environment. And secondly, well, you see in Singapore, we rarely have a lot of time or opportunity to think about other people except ourselves. When have you ever talked about people who are less fortunate or the needy? So, Excellence Primary School do not want to train and educate selfish individuals. So, we are going to introduce the concept of service learning to all of you. All of you might be thinking, what exactly is service learning? Well, service learning is actually when you conduct, um, when you engage in meaningful service learning, I'm sorry, meaningful community service, and you learn through that. It becomes a method of teaching and also learning. So through this um, service learning, we actually give back to the society. There's a lot of ways we can do service learning. We can clean up, like what we're doing on Saturday, cleaning up the school, cleaning up, um, cleaning up public places, uh, collecting old newspapers, and so on and so forth. So because we are trying out this new service learning project, we are deciding that we are going to step, we are going to try something that is close to home, which is giving back to the school community. Okay? Now, all of you here, I, I, I want to assure all of you that it will not just be the students, all your primary five teachers, including me, your mother tongue teachers and subject, te subject teachers, will also be coming down to clean up the school. Even our vice principal, Mrs. Lim, will be coming down to clean up the school on Saturday with all of you, and all of us will learn to be more responsible adults, okay? So I hope to see all of you on Saturday with a big smile and a positive attitude, and we will come down and we will definitely learn through this beneficial experience. Thank you.